Hey, what's going on guys? Let's try this problem right here. Here we have a diverging lens with focal length of negative 25 cm and for a diverging length, the focal length is always negative, right? And also we have an object placed 15 cm from this lens and the question here is asking to find out the image distance. Now, before we go ahead and solve this mathematically, let's see how is the diagram going to be. So we are, we are going to draw the ray diagram now for the diverging lens what we do is first ray we draw parallel to the normal so if we draw this one after it hit the lens what's going to happen is it's going to refract outside but uh, for the exact point what we do is we extend the extend the dot dot line from this focal point right so if we extend the dot dot line from the focal point and that's going to give us the exact direction so this is going to go like this right now we found out the first ray and the second ray is going to go like this it's going to go toward this second focal point outside of this like in the other side of the lens so if you draw like this after it hit the lens it, it don't reach anymore it's going to go parallel to the normal right so the second ray is going to look like this and that's the diagram but uh, for a human brain when the eye looks at this one this uh, human brain thinks this ray comes from the straight line because the human brain does know it's uh, refracted right here so it's going to think like it's coming from here so if we draw a dotted line right here for for the human the image is going to appear right here so this is going to be the image distance now to find this one mathematically we are going to use this equation right here s prime is equal to s f over s minus f and that's gonna give us the image distance now let's go ahead and plug the values s prime is equal to s times f over s minus f s is object distance f is focal length and s prime is the image distance now s is uh, object distance that is 15 centimeter so this is 15 and the focal length is provided that is negative 25 so we multiply this one by negative 25 in the denominator we are going to have 15 minus minus 25 so in the numerator we had 15 times negative 25 that's going to be 15 times negative 25 that's going to be negative 375 and 15 minus minus 25 so that's going to become 15 plus 25 that's going to be equal to 40 and if you calculate this one you should get negative 9.375 so this negative sign represent this is virtual that makes sense because we are having the image in front of the lens so this is definitely a virtual image right now to find whether it is upright or inverted we know from the diagram we know that this is upright but to prove that one mathematically we can use this magnification equation so according to magnification equation m is equal to m is equal to negative negative s prime over s s prime is again that's image distance we found out that one right here and s is object distance we have that one already now let's go ahead and plug the values minus minus 9.375 over 15 so this is centimeter I should mention that one this is centimeter and uh, if you calculate this one you should get 0 0.625 since we are getting the positive answer this is definitely upright and the image is going to be this much the ratio of the image is going to be this much smaller than the original object right and that's how we do this kind of problems. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching.